Hello? Hello? Hi? Hello? Ugh. Hang on. Uh, I'm doing something a little bit different. I have my, uh... I have my noise suppression on this turned off. Just so if, oh wait, I need to take off the BRV. Hang on, that needs to go away so you can actually see me. It's good, I'm, I'm proud of that, but you need to also be able to see me. Um, oh. Hey everyone, um, hello, welcome to another episode of Everything in Detail. Now, you may be thinking, what is everything in detail? What is it? Why is my, uh, why, why is my uh, Twitch chat not updating on here? Okay, there we go. Hi, hello everyone. So, let's, uh, let's talk about, uh, Let's talk about Club Penguin. Let's talk about what um, what everything in detail is before we begin. Everything is in detail is everything explained. Last time I did Scrungecraft, uh, going all the way to at, at that point in Scrungecraft. Um, that was good. That was successful. Took like four and a half hours. Didn't finish. Um, but. Your drink is making me so, so nervous. Don't worry, I did this with a Pepsi last time. It'll be fine. This is a raw sewage waste. Delicious. No, that's a uh, Arnold Palmer. So I'll be there. Don't worry. I had a whole thing of Pepsi up here last time and it didn't spill, so I'm very good. Yeah, there's 387 pages of the Club Penguin. So... Let's talk about Club Penguin. Who? Who the fuck is this? Let me tell you. So, Club Penguin is... I, I'm gonna be honest, I don't really know much about Club Penguin. It's one of those browser-based kid MMOs. Like, sort of in a similar vein of Toontown or uh, Nicktropolis, I think was one. So, Pop Tropica 2, I guess. I played like 10 minutes of Pop Tropica. Um, that's really about it. It's. Club Penguin was one of the big children browser based MMOs. Um, it's. I don't really even know how to quite describe it. Um, I play it to kind of get a feel of how it is, but I'm a few years too late for that. So, Nectropolis is legit lost media now. Yeah, a, a lot of the old, um, old, late 2000s, early 2010s browser-based MMOs are lost media. Nectropolis, um, there's probably like a few Disney ones as well. Uh, club, like really Club Penguin and Club Penguin and Two Town are really the only ones that I've ever seen like actually rise from the dead. We got rid of all the good I I and on Pop Torpica. Yeah. Friend is in the chat knows a lot about Club Penguin. Yeah, um I might I might have some guests on. Uh in particular Leland, who is a petrifying Club Penguin Pookie Wiki expert. Uh, literally horrifying. But let me show you what materials I have today. I don't have a whole lot of... Actually, I need a pair of scissors. I don't have a whole lot of, like, smaller ones today. But although I did just remember that I forgot to cut some of these. Um, let me show you what I have here. I have a lot of documents. And these aren't funny images. This is far, this is far from it. These are not, uh, these are not funny images. These are, this is, I'm gonna put that over there. Uh, we, we need to cut those. 
So I have a lot of uh, spreadsheets here. Um, we went. <laughs> my dad. <laughs> Luckily for me, um, I have. Here's one of them. I went ahead and took the Poochie, Pookie, whatever catchphrases page and I printed them out on this nice spreadsheet. Actually, I have more. One. That isn't it. Gucci. I said, I say words. Uh, this is one? Wait, wait, what is this? I have like, I'm gonna be honest, I have like three documents of things uh, Pookies say and I don't quite, okay, this is it. This is the main one. This is like the 100 long one and I have a few spreadsheets of these. Um, donate and I will pick one from this. Um, wait. Okay, yeah, that's fine. Uh, so do I need help? I'm gonna get through my intro real quick. I'm sort of gonna explain what this all is, and then I'll get in a voice call. Uh, there's the catchphrases. I have images. I need to cut. I need to cut these images. One of them's important. I don't know why I didn't do this before I started stream. This is an arts and crafts stream now. Um, this is actually important to have all of these. Let's see. What are these? Oh, these are good ones. I'm gonna I'm gonna hold on to these ones. These look like good ones, right there. Um, I don't. Oh yeah, I know what these are. I'm gonna be like <laughs> Leland's corkboard with red string. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So we kind of know what Club Penguin is now. Um, they existed on Club Penguin. And I'm going to say existed in past tense, because I refuse to believe that this is still a thing. There's a, a sub-community, I'll call it, called, well, essentially Club Penguin Pookies. Pookies, that's the important word. That's the important word that can go up there. Um, it is still a thing? Upsetting. Um, anyway. Uh, what else is on here? So we need to, we need to talk. Um, I have a, well. I need to organize. <laughs> this is another, this is another catchphrases spreadsheet. That needs to go over there. Pookie still exists. That's upsetting. But, um. All right, well, I mean, Scrungecraft was still good. What is this? I don't even I don't even know where that page this came from. This is the best spreadsheet because it's barely legible. Um, there's a few, uh... <laughs> this is, this, okay, I want to preface this. Do not edit. Because of his stream, do not edit the Club Penguin Pookie Wiki. Do not. That's sacred ground, hollowed ground. Dead bodies are there. I don't want to tread on that. Don't, don't put my name on there. I don't want to be there. Um, <laughs> the Club Penguin Pookie Wiki has a lot of tables, and naturally you'd think tables would be easy to um, put into spreadsheets, but as you can see, the Club Penguin Pookie Wiki hates Google Docs, so that can go there. Um. Oh yeah, um, you you can also look at this. You can see where like why it was printed out so long and narrow. Um, this one's just called methods of abuse, which we'll talk about that in a moment. Um, what else do I got here? Uh, 
This is the diva one. I need to put that over there. <laughs> this is important for later. This is important too. Um, okay. You cannot edit it. Do not edit the Club Penguin Pookie Wiki. Anyway, this is a Pookie. You might think, oh, that just looks like a normal penguin from Club Penguin. But no, not at all. No, 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 um, no, 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 um, club, uh, Pookie, you know Adopt Me from Roblox, right? Family RPs, you know them, right? Someone out there has to, uh, you know, how, um, a lot of, so, Pookies as a, uh, as a sub-community is a sub-community of what is essentially family RP. Um, you have people who, uh, you have people who, uh, roleplay as... Well, you have a few different subsets. You have a, a few different subsets. Some of them are here in my in my hands. Um, some of them are over there. Some of them are fucking crazy, and I'll talk about those in a moment. Um, so what we have here is there's a few different uh, subsets of this. The, the main one, the primary, uh, the primary facet of the Club Penguin Pookie Wiki is Pookies, which is children, baby penguins, and people role play as this, okay? And the primary purpose of, of the role play is, the, the primary purpose of the role play is for the Pookie uh, side of things is to get um, get adopted, essentially get chosen by a Moo Moo or a M M Moo Moo M U M U Moo Moo or uh, a a Dada D U D U. Uh, you're essentially it's it's adopt me. You want to get adopted by a, a mom, a dad. Um, a mom, a dad, that's important, and yeah, the Pookie and Wiki needs to be perfectly preserved. I will not tolerate anyone going there and messing with it. Do not touch that. That is something that needs to be preserved. I, I want to get that clear. I don't want anyone touching that. Um, so what you usually get is on with that, you get well role playing. Um, Pookies role play as children, babies, moms role play as moms, dads, dads. I hope you understand how that works. So, you get roleplay, and so this is a th this is a pretty good like representation, like single screenshot representation of usually what happens along with these. But don't worry, this gets deep. Um, that's all the magnets I have. Sadly, I have two more over there, but I don't care. Um, <sighs> made a fandom account to scrub socks off the face of the earth. Oh shit! Hang on. Stab and donate five dollars. Say a pookie catchphrase, please. I never asked before. Oh God, give me a moment. This is just a piece of paper. Uh, okay. Here, this is literally like a single. This is a single page of poochie of pookie. Catchphrases. There's four pages here of just spreadsheets. Um, okay, let's see.
I don't... Uh... <laughs> I just saw the best one. Uh... <laughs> Oh yeah, there's a ton of old MMOs that have been going on since like the late 90s, early 2000s. I'm looking through it. There's a lot. Um, I almost said it. <laughs> Wait. What really fucks me up about this is that there's no consistency. We talked about this. There's no consistency with any of these phrases. <sighs> Let's see. Oh god, is Furcadia bad? I have no, I have no clue. Okay, um, look up here. How about this one? <clears throat> I didn't practice at all. I usually practice before I do voice acting. Um, I didn't. Uh. <laughs> Um, there's a lot here. Like, I'm, I'm trying to, like, nail down something I want to say, and there's just so much. <laughs> it's so, so small! <laughs> That's one. That's a good one. Here. There that is, you can probably read it from here. What else do we got? Holds Wista's brother's hand tightly. What else do we got? I don't want to look at that anymore. Um. You have to say slash? If, if you're gonna be so if you're gonna if you're gonna if you're gonna, if, if you're gonna like police how I'm doing this I'm gonna say the sucks on flippers gets you a warning Thank you. Thank you for following I now have to say slash out loud. I'll read this word for word letter for letter um That one that one fucks me up all the time sucks on flippers Gets you a warning. It specifically notes it gives you a warning. I don't even know why it's on the page. It, it gives you a warning. <laughs> Second life, next life. Uh oh. Um. So, what was I talking about? Let's talk about like. Let's talk about a. Let, let's get something out of the way real quick. So the Club Penguin Pookie Wiki is canon. It is a canon Club Penguin Pookie Wiki canon. There's no fanon available. There's no fanon. Um, but there is something here. Meldus? It's canon to Scrunchcraft. I, I feel like I may have said something wrong. So the Club Penguin Pookie Wiki is canon. 100% canon. There are two main posts on the front page that specifically states no fanon, only canon. And that is petrifying to me. But what it also contains is a link. A link to the Club Penguin Pookie fanfiction slash fanon wikia. Um... I went onto that wikia. This is what greeted me. 
and I left the page and I do not want to go back. Mean evil lying divas. I don't want to go back there. So I went, I was on it for a grand total of 10 seconds, took a screenshot and left because I felt like it was going to like destroy my computer. <laughs> yeah, it's all it's all wonderful. Let's talk about um and let's talk about types of pookies. I thought I had printed this out, but I don't think I did. Hang on. I'm on the, I'm on their page now. This is why I have the uh Oh my god. There's a lot of pages here! Holy shit! Where did this page come from? Oh! <laughs> did you know the original Club Penguin devs actually hate Pookies? Damn, add, don't. add them to the Pookie haters page. Um, there's a few... I want I want I want to list off a few of the types of pookies. There's normal pookies. Normal. Something I want to note with pookies, most of the time um they're yellow. That's important. I'm going to say this right now. There's some surprisingly heavy shit in this. Um The page about tomboy pookies and tom girl pookies is miserable. Is it on here? Yes, it is. Hang on. I need to adjust my Google Chrome stuff. Yes. Yes. Um... Let's talk about. Let's. <laughs> Let's talk about. So. <laughs> Pookies are usually yellow. Yes. There's usually um. There are sometimes. So, I want to mention. I'm gonna mention this right now, that there is a category. There are categories on the Club Penguin Pookie Wiki, and some of the categories include. <laughs> there is a. Uh, there is a category on the Club Penguin Pookie Wiki for racism and there's only one page in that category which i feel like is really important to note really really important to note <laughs> there is <laughs> this is incredible who followed i need a, i need a thank you <laughs> jinx thank you so <laughs> there is a page I have it right here, actually. There's a page on the Club, Club Penguin um, Pookie Wiki called Discolored Pookies. You can guess what that's about. Oh, ye oh, uh, Leland just posted death, and that means I need to show you that I actually printed off the page for death because I felt like it was a really important article. We're not going to talk about racism anymore. Um, let me read you deaths. The page for death. Thank you so much. Um, caring for a pookie is fun, but it is not all fun in games. A pookie or other family member may die, and die is bolded. Once your pookie is dead, it can slash cannot be revived. 
that is a that's a heavy sentence in itself i would like to know what pookie resurrection is like um reasons a pookie might die <laughs> your pookie got severely injured your pookie became very sick you forgot to feed your pookie or give it water which is very cool um it drowned it fell down which i like to imagine that's like trips and not like I'm, I'm thinking of an old like Miiverse post where it's like oh no a rock dies it was smothered bludgeoned shot or stabbed suicide randomly eaten alive by an arcade cabinet ways to prevent a pookie from dying Warning, these do not always work. <laughs> Feed and give water to your pookie regularly. Never hurt your pookie in any way. Make sure your pookie stays safe. Place puffle guards around the oven slash fireplace. Teach your pookie how to swim so they don't drown. That's the death page. I'm just gonna put that right there because that feels like I need to reference that for later. Um, so death is a serious problem for Pookie cabinet man moments. <laughs> um, death is a serious um condition in on the Pookie wiki. Um, it usually means you're dead, which is mostly bad. As if it is not a decision made by the Pookie. The way that page is phrased too mostly acts like Pookie, like it mostly refers to Pookies as a pet, which is wild to me. Like this is family, like this is mostly family RP. The concept of. Uh, <laughs> We're gonna continue. Um, we're gonna talk about Pookie abuse. Because we're segueing from dying. Where's my paper? Where's my paper for this? Here we are. Nope, that's not it. It's, wait. Ah, uh, here we are. This was from a table from the wiki. Um, the table was just, I think it was just called Methods of Abuse. Um, up, uppy, no, we can't talk about abuse because we need to talk about how families work. We need to talk about how families work. Um, there, are, there is a, a family classification on the Pookie wiki. Um, so what you have is, we have, we have separate categories of people wait didn't i i have i had this isn't it hang on i have an important one here we are here we are so here is some of the it's a real good spreadsheet i can't really show you it here are some of the types of well, I don't want to say pookies, but just this sort of what role you can fill. There's, of course, pookie. Uh, they made sure to give an age of ages one through seven. Um, common, yes, hopefully. School grade, um, pre-K or elementary school. Uh, description, baby penguins, very apt. Home with the fam fam. Yes, the fam fam. If you, you don't have a family. You have a fam fam, which is, I, I, I feel uh, a, a terrible, uh, a, a terrible aging of that phrase, but whatever. Yeah. Yeah, I've got like the types of, like the sizes of fam fams right here on this paper, and I've got what you can be. So we have 
a lot of what this does is it's done uh, through the perspective of child speak but the issue is that that child speak isn't very good i mentioned that it's not consistent at all and i really do mean it is inconsistent there's a lot here um so instead of sister or brother you have wista or broder brother so you have miss middle wista slash broder which is 8 through 14 they are common um middle school or high school much like teens only smaller and younger which is confusing with the fam they live with the fam fam then you have the biggie wista or brother um which is ages 15 through 19 they are common uh they're usually in high school or college um basically teenagers so the previous one was teenagers but younger and this one is just teenagers which is a, a good sh showing here um you have the moo moo slash dada which actually i'm said that i spelled that out wrong earlier it's d-u-h d-u-h da da which is ages 20 through 60 so um good they are common um they're usually in college or have a job adults that look after the fam fam there is a note wait there's a note on the biggie wista or broder which says home with a fam fam mostly in parentheses um we have the banana slash aunt slash uncle slash grandpa which is just normal because but that normalcy in the name doesn't last long because in the age it says 60 to 100 or 20 to 60 for an ah uh ah -uh slash un un when I was eight years old, I was able to say uncle and aunt just fine. Ah, oh, ah, oh, and un, un? They are not common. <laughs> um, school grade is not applicable, but it notes that they may have retired or have a job. And that's good. Um, Description visits maybe lives in parentheses in I like this because it says visits in may in parentheses maybe lives and then in the fam fam so if you take out the parentheses it says visits in the fam fam which I don't know what that means um home is own home with their own life or with fam fam which you can you can actually see on the spreadsheet spreadsheet it's actually going out of the box <laughs> so. The uppy. What is an uppy? They can be any age. They are common. Usually none. Rarely hospital uppy and or guard dog. Uppies are dogs, I think. I think. Protects the fam fam and are very loyal pets. Uppies are also good trash cans, so you can feed them leftovers. No sweets. <laughs> Club Penguin Pookie Wiki Gotcha. Um, there's Kitty. Um, any age? No. Uh, not common. Um, school grade? None. Description: Eats mice. Hates uppies most of the time. With the fam fam. Bunny, any age, not common, no school grading, usually stays in cages, loves carrots, um, with the fam fam. <laughs> yeah, I wish, and my, my school grade right now is none, I think. Um, so that's, um, that's the common, I'm going to say that's like the, the meta, this is the meta list of fam fam members. There's a meta here. Um... And so then you usually have fam fam size. Um, you have a, a, a size of your family, your fam fam. 
which is real good because the first one, type homeless. Usually one parent and one or two pookies. Pookie, uh, the, the Club Penguin Pookie Wiki and community um, experiences homelessness, which is incredible. Um, the next subtype is small. It, it, it gets really long from here. Hang on, I should have my alert box. Thank you, Bug. Um, Bug, actually, you can see you're still in my Wii. So where is the FamFam Fam RP taking place exactly? Were there player homes or were these in the public spaces? Both, actually. Um, which is actually important why I have these, these here, which you can't see because of the logo. Um, both. You would see these role plays happen. <laughs> Thank you, Rob. Um, you would see these role plays take place within um, public spaces for like getting picked. But yeah, most of it would be in player homes um, because that's the fam fam. There are private servers. I'm not. Uh, Leland, you know better about the private servers than I do. But a lot of them actually got. Uh, Cease and desist notices, so that's good. Um, so the the next up type is small, one parent, rarely two, or one to three pookies, or a pet, which is confusing in its wording, because it can be one parent, rarely two. Or one to three pookies, so you can have no parents. Or a pet, which a pet can be it. You have a normal. This is a, the classification for a normal fam fam. Tell me. Tell me. Does this accurately represent your life? Do you have a mom and dad, a moo moo slash dada, one to four pookies, one biggie, and one to three pets. Does that accurately describe you? <laughs> bam bam can be eight dadas. The fun thing about that one is that's about um that's one less sibling than my family has. So, that's good. I have a huge family. Um, then there's a big. You have a, a Mumu, a Dada, three to six Pookies, some Biggies in middles, unspecified, and about four pets. Does that describe you? Does that describe your Club Penguin fam fam? <laughs> Oh shit, I need to look at this page. Um, hang on, let me finish this. The next type is huge. You have a Moo Moo, you have a Dada, you have Pookies. At this point, numbers don't matter. You have Pookies, you have Biggies, Middles, you have Aunts, Uncles, Pets, Grandmas and Grandpas. Does that describe you? Then there's Gigantic. Gigantic. Moo Moo, Dada. Babysitters, pookies, biggies, middles, young middles, aws, ununs, cuz cuzes, grandmas, grandpa, gram, grampies, uppies, kitties, butlers, maids, bunnies, and farm animals. Usually a big fam fam. Does that describe you? Anyway, I need to look at the Club Penguin Pookie Wiki uh, page for illnesses because I didn't actually do that yet, and that's a good page. The flu. The flu on Club Penguin is nearly the same as it is in real life. That's petrifying. <laughs> Oh good, there's a, no, there's, a, there's a line here at the end. 
which notes, however, there are different types of flu. Flu virus such as the bird flu, H5N1, acts as the normal flu, yet is fatal. So, that's good. In fact, preschool pookies will be sent home so they do not pass the illness to the other pookies. Colors will sometimes be white or even green at home. She slash he will not want to play or eat. They will drink water and take naps frequently. Um, awesome. Oh, good. There's a patron natural disasters. I'm going to look at that later. Um, there's colds. Dehydration. This illness is very rare. Tummy bug. Um, they can die. That is the most important page I, I printed out. There's a page about Pookie Ghost? There's like 500 pages on this wiki. There's so much. Um, I like that there's tummy bug, and this one's like the most descriptive of its uh, symptoms. Dizziness, headache, nausea, chills, pale skin, vertigo, fever, vomiting. Awesome. Signs your Pookie will have a tummy bug. Pookies will complain in the morning. There you go. Um, fever. That's good. Gastro. Awesome. Asthma. <laughs> Wait, asthma's like the only, like, asthma's like the first thing on here that has a, a, a section called cure, and it specifically mentions it is not curable, but an inhaler can help. Awesome. Uh, there's a page here for allergies. Um, hypothermia. Throat infection. Strep throat. Awesome. Let me look at natural disasters, because that seems fucking wild to me. Tornadoes, earthquakes, blizzards, hurricanes, tsunamis, floods, volcano eruptions, forest fires, mudslides, and avalanches. Wait, wait, this page just has fucking real life images of, of, of fucking natural disasters. What? Huh? Wait, this is the first page that has like actual real life images. Why? I mean, I guess it's because like fucking Club Penguin doesn't have natural disasters in it. But that's hilarious to me. That's actually hilarious to me. Holy shit, I'm expecting to like scroll down on this page and I get an image of a fault lines explain to me how an earthquake starts Club penguin tsunami leading to nuclear reactor breach <laughs> Oh, we need to um I mean, there was a time everyone nearly froze to death in lore. That's something I'm gonna need to bring Leland on for. Wait, there's a section here called more info. Click here for more info about natural disasters and it takes you to the Wikipedia page for natural disasters. <laughs> they used to have pics of avalanche victims like in character. In character, right? Real life ones? What the fuck? Oh my god. See, this is this is why this is why I'm looking at the Club Penguin Pookie Wiki. No, I'm fucking around, sorry. That would have been hilarious. I have so much trust. Um well, now that we've talked about natural disasters, can we talk about uh, Pookie abuse in the Pookie Haters Association? Or whatever it's called. What's it called? Pookie Haters Defense. PDF. Or PhD. That's, that's what I was thinking of. PhD. So let's talk about people who are against the Pookies. 
let's talk about this is why I printed out these images let me get let me show you some of these so the pookie hater defense would do <laughs> The Pookie hater defense would do protests that are anti-Pookie. Um, here's here's an image from the war. That's historical. That's just gonna go here. This is now we're gonna talk about Pookie abuse, and this is my my this is my favorite image of all fucking time. It's something so like mystical to this image i love it that's going up too that's going like right here drinks blood is my favorite line <laughs> drinks blood so where did i put the pookie abuse paper i put it here here here. So, here's Pookie abuse, which I, I made sure to put this down into a table. Um, so this uh, ab abuse, um, attacking um, methods of abuse. Let's talk about this for a moment. <laughs> Methods of abuse Attempting to skill In parentheses Kill them Because skill um, Club Penguin has a language filter Kill gets picked up Skill does not Start I need to nap Do you need to, Do you want to like Wait Do you want to come on and like we can talk about the best things? But I need to nap. I can't fact check for you. That's okay. That's all right. Um. I can't be your Fox News fact checker. That's okay. I have a Club Penguin Pookie Wiki here. And I can, uh, rely on that. I can rely on this. Um, well, and, and now that Leland's leaving, let's talk about Pookie abuse. This is actually, like, completely <laughs> thank you Dud on Leland <clears throat> um while I'm in bed I will tell you anything I trust you I don't um I don't trust myself with this but let's go so methods of abuse let's go through it I curated this list a little bit because it gets a bit fucked up so these are just the, the ones that are good um, shooting them, scarring them, breaking into their room, painting on their skin, breaking them and taking their quarters, bashing in their face with a crowbar, wicking, kicking, and pushing them over, kitting, hitting them, bunching, punching them, throwing them in the oven, Locking them in a cage. Hitting them with a baseball bat, golf club, frying pan, etc. Poisoning them. Burning their clothes. Starving them. Holding their head underwater, like that scene in John Wick. Isolating them. Threatening them. Throwing various objects at them, such as rocks, boxes, etc. Throwing them out the window, aka proper demonstration of defenestration. 
feeding them animal food, putting their teddy in a shredder. The crowbar line in there is hilarious to me because that seems like such a niche thing, but it's like, here's like the major list of pooky abuse that could happen. Um, it's wonderful. Now, now, so, you would see this a lot on Club Penguin. Oh, hang on, there's another image here. There's like a, there's like a red, this image is like, a, a, an image where it's like spot the difference, where there's a red circle around the pookie that's being mean, because this is like a little 1024 by 1024 image of someone's browser. It's so specific. It's so specific. That's why I love drinks blood. That is hilarious to me. Why is it always crowbars? Is because pookies are Silent Hill enemies. I believe it. Pookies are my sins. Um, I'm gonna hang on. I'm gonna get into the private Discord. I feel like it's important. I'm gonna get into the, uh... This channel's called Echo Chamber Deluxe, so that sounds pretty good. If anyone in the, uh... If anyone in the... If any Scrunchcraft members want to join me. I mean, or avoid me. He put the scissors over there. Let's talk about language. Let's talk about language in the Pookie uh, place. This is for divas. We'll talk about that in a moment. Here we are. So Pookies are interesting in which I talked about this with Leland on a success stream. And we actually got like analytical about this where it's like most of the people role playing this are teenagers and such and it's like sort of like the thing of wanting to revisit your childhood or something pookieology yeah that's what i'm gonna call it but what this sort of segued into is our discussion on how <laughs> see you leland um uh, what this uh, segued into was the discussion of inconsistency. Um, the people who are role-playing this don't really... I'm going to say, like, it, it seems almost like an exaggerated version of children, but more so just a misunderstanding of how children, like, young children speak. Because... Uh, I, I mentioned earlier I had no like I'm I'm pretty sure most I ha I, I have to say for most uh, I, I I have to I'm kind of uh, blinking on my words here for the most part the people role playing this don't really know how children speak I'm pretty sure most of the children like most children out there are going to know how to say mom dad aunt uncle but that's not that's not what really happens here it's almost exaggerated in a way it's a german it's a drama a dramatized version of how a children uh, how a child would act how a child would say words some of them include like while the idea is a base level it's something you can work off of um the issue arises this is i'm going to presume a pretty big community this is a lot of people doing this there is a substantial amount of people quad quadruple digits sextuple digits this is a lot of people like there's a good number of people doing this and so the issue is that you get a lot of inconsistencies in language and what that kind of ends up happening is from an outsider looking in, 
Um, whenever you see, like, billions of people, even, maybe trillions, yeah. Um, but r r really, uh, there's, so, what, what happens is that when you make, when the Pookie, the Club Penguin Pookie Wiki, um, decided, let's have pages for catchphrases, for specific catchphrases, for sort of uh, what each word means. The issue is you have a lot of people slowly forming this, and also um, I wouldn't say uh, everyone working on the Club Penguin Pookie Wiki are stellar writers. You get a lot of inconsistencies. You get a lot of words that you sort of take a moment, step back, and realize this doesn't make sense, or this doesn't, uh, it, this isn't, like, th this is inconsistent from this one, etc., etc. So what you get is a lot here. And because what I'm specifically getting at is that you have a lot of situations where on this on the four page catchphrase there on that page there's a lot of words that a lot that are implying that a pookie is able to pronounce an l correctly or an r correctly or an s correctly or something of the like like um, when you <laughs> uh, you 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 get a lot of that like inconsistencies where at the same time there's catchphrases and words here that are implied that they are not able to do that. They are not able to do their L's. Their L's sound like W's. Their R's sound like H's. W's, they sound like they're not as pronounced as they could be. Same thing with S's. Same thing with T's. Um, you get a lot of that here. Like a T H is what I'm saying here. And that's very inconsistently done. And that kind of leads to a little bit of a frustration um, trying to read these because there's no consistent style. There's no consistent style here at all. This is my critic. This is my criticism. Welcome to everything in detail where I criticize the language of a club penguin pookie wiki. This is what my content is. Holy hell. Um. You step back. Oh, Serpy, welcome. Hello. Hello. Hewo. Wee Wee Wello. Wee -wo. Yeah, Wee -wo. that's, that's what I want to mention. There's like four very like, epitop, hi and hello. There's four variations of it, and it's, they're all inconsistent. Why? Well, whoa. Wello. Hello. -wo. -wo. They all change. There's no consistency here. That's part of a magic. That's part of a frustration. Weewo. Wista. Sissy. Swister. Um, I like that on the bottom here, the word for cool becomes tool. And I, I'm, I'm sure that sounds, uh, that looks, that's very easy to parse in um, uh, Club Penguin. What I'm saying is that the Pookies are calling people tools. Um, but like Leland said, this is like part of like a larger community of like, I guess like baby role players. Yeah, like um, yeah, because I like uh, this like uh, uh, this like type of language ar like arose from a certain community in one place and then like spread to other communities. Yeah. It's almost like a game of telephone. Everything builds and builds and builds on top of each other. People from different communities with different ideas coming in and meshing into this beautiful mess. Absolutely tremendous. Um, we talked about language for a little bit, and that was like the most serious conversation that I've had in a long time. Um, let's talk about pookie types now, because, uh, sure. Everything ends with Pookie. What page? Here we are. So there are types of Pookies. Let's talk. Let's talk about the types of Pookies. Um, if I'm not careful, we'll walk ba right back into Pookie racism. But let's try to avoid that. Let's talk about 
uh, Diva Pookies, which I need to open up the image of the, the, the page for. Um, let me let me read you a little bit of a description from the Diva Pookies page. Diva Pookies are mean, sassy, over-the-top Pookies who think they are better than everyone else. I'm going to be honest, I saw Mel. I was... I'm, I'm biding my time until I get to the melds. Um, sometimes they are sly with their ways and like nothing more than tormenting and tricking people to picking them then betraying them or abusing them. They abuse non-members and non-rare pookies and are very picky with a family. They want and believe they deserve. And sometimes they might blame the other sisters or brothers for stuff they did. Rarely diva pookies are nice. I'm learning about non-members now, which I'm going to stop looking at. Um, oh, okay, Soapy. Yeah, no worries. Oh, um, there's... The, the important thing on this page was the catchphrases, which I made sure to print out because there's some pretty good ones on here, which I can barely read you get some of these free of charge um what, what do we got we got uh we got woo mot rare woo mot rare woo mot rare all right woo mot rare Woo Mont Rare. There's something important here. We're going back into the language. Woo. You. Woo to Like you to woo. Okay, sure. Mot. Not to mot. Confusing, sure. Rare. I feel like a kid, a, a pookie, would have a harder time saying rare than you or not. That's the state of this discussion. Is that I keep going back into language. Which is important because one of these words is um, OT, which is for OK. And I thought OT was so funny that I put it into Vonocrypta. That is now a Vonocrypta word. There you go. I think it means damned. So that's good. Um, there's... So, there's a lot of different types of pookies. Diva pookies are mean ones. There's... <clears throat> what are they? Nukies? Yeah, nukies. Which are nerd pookies. Which, every time I see nukies, that sounds like either a type of really sour hard candy or a Nokia phone. Um, there's... I did it all for the nookie! Um, there's, okay, yes, the amp scale, I fucking forgot about the amp scale, let's talk about the amp scale. <clears throat> the amp scale is a scale used for uh, describing the behavior of pookies. Um, this is... A nice like a, a, this is a uh, a good reference material for like this is this is part of the the Club Penguin Pookie Wiki that is interesting because it's actively like it's actively something that assists new people getting into this, which is actually interesting because you see this issue a lot of the time with some communities where. Uh, they're not exactly in, in accepting or inviting of new members. And this isn't something where it's like they just straight up say it. This is something where 
resources are limited. Information about what to do, what is done, is more and so known per, per person. So this is interesting where you actually have um, you actually have a scale that can be used. Um, my favorite part is that one of the two scales is in here is made in like MS Paint Comic Sans. Take a look at that, baby. Yeah, that's good. There's a there's a better one on the page and it's above it, but I think that's like incredibly. Um, I think I think that's really really funny. It what it essentially does is that it goes. Um, the top is like the devastating ones. The bottom is the nice one. I don't know what's going on here. Um, you, you you got the nine, you got the devastating ones on the top. You got the devastating ones on the bottom. Like, um, I, I wish I printed this out so I could just easily show it to you. But there's nice citizen pookies. There's uh, regular pookies, then it goes to naughty pookies. What I find really interesting about this graph is that there's like two sections for actually good ones, I and mean, it goes in like f four sections of bad ones, which is incredibly weird. Category evil, this is what I'm looking for. Ghosts! I wanted to talk about ghosts because um, there are ghosts. We of course, there's death um there's death and then of course with death um it is canonicized in the club penguin pookie community that there is i guess while while not necessarily uh an afterlife there is ghosts so that's um good i like i like this though Pookie ghosts sometimes act a little more mature than typical pookies, and sometimes speak normally. Um, there's a lot of noises. We're gonna let these noises play out. Killer pookies. Killer pookies are a type of pookie that mainly kill their siblings, parents, and and or other pookly pookies. I don't know where everyone's coming from. I don't know where all these gamers are coming from. Um, there's a lot of the <laughs> there's there's a lot to this. There's a lot to this which confuses me a lot. Um, like killer pookies, there's ghost pookies. There's a lot to it. Uh, where's melds? Where is melds? Baporo posted the page for melds, and I want to take a look at melds. Or melm, whatever it is. Mean, evil, lying moo-moos, abbrevi abbreviated as melm, are like meanie moo-moos, but these work in a community. They are very abusive, and they never love their pookies at all, which is something that is wild to me. I, I, I keep saying this is wild. It's, it's wild that there's a lot of, like, there, there's a lot of layers to how everyone in this community sort of acts like it's it's layered all on top of each other it's <laughs> it's something that i rarely see it's something that i very rarely see and it's interesting it's also interesting how a lot of it is evil um a lot of this a lot of this is evil uh It's just evil. What else do I got here? I feel like I printed something else off that I can talk about. Those are the catchphrases. This is... I 
I don't know what that is. That's more in like catchphrases, but almost sort of tra uh, translations. That's the the size family size chart. That's the uh, <laughs> methods of abuse paper. That's the diva catchphrases. This is death. I'm gonna put death back over here. That's important. I'm pretty. Can I? That's important to be up there. So that's. Wow, there's a lot of gamers tonight. Uh, let's look at Melds, Melms, Meldu, whatever. Mean, evil, lying, diva, uppy. Wait. What? Wait. The, the, the thing that tends, the whole thing that confuses me with uppies is that they're dogs. Oh. They're uh, dogs, I, I guess. Um, uh... Uh, uppies are dogs, and then there's, uh, Meldus, which is, they are like melds, but they are uppies. Most Meldus are biters. They uh, bite others or treat them rudely when no one is looking and blames it on another pookie. Um, wonderful. That is wonderful. Uh... How to not fall for Meldu tricks. This is a good section. Wait. Oh, yeah. Contact a Pookie protector. I guess this is actually where I want to talk about... Uh, where is it? Where is the page? I have like 10 pages open now. There's a... Uh, uh, there's a few... I'm going to call them organizations... There, there's a few organizations revolving around and when I say organizations I mean like in the sense of it being an organized group rather than a company uh, there's a few organizations surrounding the Pookie community um, some of them is like what, the main one I like the, the two main ones that I remember reading about were uh, Pookie protectors something and then there is uh, what was it Pookie hater defenders yeah Pookie hater defense um, and then there is the Pookie protection program <laughs> there goes up there goes a new blood oath I still don't have an idea of what blood oath does oh well um there's still, well, so there's Pookie Hate Hater Defense. <laughs> Pookie Hater Defense, and then there's a Pookie Protection Program. These are um, former organizations. Um, they're, they're, what you, uh, they're, they're what you think they are. Pookie Hater Defense is Pookie Haters, and that's where... Uh, That's where this one comes into play. So you'd get like, there was an image on the Pookie Wiki that was like, here's a, here's a warning that we're going to protest. And it was the funniest image that I've ever seen. Is this it? No. Wait, is this it? Yes. <laughs> here's the, uh, here's one of the warnings for a Pookie protest on Club Penguin. You can take a look there. Uh, so it's a Pookie warning, the Great Club Penguin Riot. When? 4th of August, 2014. Now what I love about this warning is that it tells you it's on the 4th of August, 2014. And then right underneath it, it says, this will go on for days and days, anytime. And then also gives you the time of nine, uh, 
the time of 9 a.m. And also doesn't uh, give you like a time zone. So it's just 9 a.m. 9 a.m. anytime. Yeah, <laughs> everywhere. It's 9 a.m. somewhere in the world or wh whatever it is. Nope, ben, ben already beat me to that one. Um, so that's where we lead into Pookie haters. Because, of course, you've got this large community of people who are doing this. You're going to get a, a large community of people that hate it. Which isn't always the case, but is most definitely the case in this situation. Um, you'd get, like, huge protests of people just saying, like, no more pookies or something. Which is cool. It happens wherever it strikes 9 a.m. in any time zone. Oh, God. There's a protest for pookies somewhere in the world every hour. That's petrifying. Um... So, <laughs> what? I'm looking at another image of a Pookie protest and I can barely comprehend anything that is being said. A new protest started 15 minutes ago. Oh God. So that's where we lead into Pookie haters, which, hang on, let me go onto the page. This is a page that used to have uh, Sox's stream on before we recovered that page and brought it back to how it should be. Um, Pookie haters, as the name suggests, are people who dislike or hate Pookies. I I like some of the reasons. There's a section on here for some of the reasons a person might hate Pookies. And m my favorite one on here is they got trolled by Pookies in the past, or by people dressed like Pookies, so now they think all Pookies are trolls, which is funny. Um, I'm not really sure why you need to describe, um, why, why you need to really describe why someone might hate Pookies. That seems almost... That seems almost uh, like you, you sort of get the idea just by knowing, but they have them on here. They also have types of Pookie haters, which the first one is normal. You can be a normal Pookie hater. You can uh, be normal. You can... Uh, you, you just hate Pookies, but you're normal. Um... There's picketers, which are the protesters, the, uh, this image. People who actively, actively, um, protest Pookie's existence. Uh, there's scary, which, which is funny. Um, scary ones are those that attempt to scare Pookies, which goes back into the... Where is it? Where is it? Here it is. The, uh, the methods of abuse, which is scarring them. You can scare them. Uh, traumatize them. Scary. Uh, there's killer. Killer? Drinks blood. Disguise. Disguise Pookie haters dress up as a fam fam member and try to get adopted, acting like a stereotypical Pookie. Once they get picked, and unlock the fam fam's trust. They may become annoying and begin to troll the fam fam members. Sometimes becoming violent. These haters don't usually stay haters because they often begin to think that role playing is fun. <laughs> um. Uh, 
I like the trivia. The Pookie Hater Defense, PhD, used to be a group of Pookie haters. In a similar vein, the Pookie Protection Program worked hard to reduce the number of Pookie haters. But when the founder, Omega Sonic, um, quit the agency, uh, the Pookie Protection Program was declared dead. So, there's a little bit of history for you. Kind of takes me back a little bit to the Roblox days where I would, um, very, I would, uh, Oh, there's a lot of these. Wait. Wait. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> oh my god. Wait, these are a lot of names. Holy shit. Wait, animal names. These are some names used for animals. Angel, Blanky, Blossom, Blueberry, Bubbles, Buttons. Candy, carrots, cheesecake, cherry, chocolate, cookie, cookies and cream, cookie dough. Oh man, there's a lot of here. Mud, I like that one. Milky Way, I like that one. You know, this one's not as accurate because everyone that I know that owns a cat names them something um, ridiculous. Um, like dismay doom concrete look at me cat named larry Wait, is larry in here i don't see larry you can name a cat larry though um i want to name a cat concrete now yeah concrete is a surprisingly common name that i see for cats Wow, there's even like middle names here. Wait, why have a middle? That's weird. So you you get you get this a lot in you you get this a lot in uh community like you you get this a lot in roleplay communities where. There's two very distinct uh, sides of a, a group. You you get the you get the people that support it. You get the people that hate it. I see this a lot. Like I, I see this a lot, and uh, uh, I, I you see this a lot. Um, and it's always interesting to me, and especially in this case, because. Uh, Club Penguin sort of seems like the game that is very much geared for role playing. Um, although I do, I I do like the reason that they like a reason a person might hate Pookies is that they think Pookies are trying to replace Puffles. That's interesting to me. Um, I never again. As I as I prefaced in the beginning of this, I never really was. I never really was too much. Actually, like I didn't know much about Club Penguin. I kind of knew about Puffles, um, but I wouldn't. I didn't really know. <laughs> yeah. I I I didn't really understand. Like that one in particular, uh, but I guess puffles are like such a big thing in Club Penguin, and people want to uh, like people think that people want to replace them with role players. I I, I guess I don't know. This this entire thing is an inside uh, like outsider looking in perspective. And a lot of it uh, bewilders me. Can we talk about canon versus fanon again? I mentioned earlier that I went on to, because there's two wikis. There's the canon wiki. I think it has to do with rewritten not having puffles. Oh, yeah, because isn't rewritten like. 
before the third iteration of Club Penguin or something of the like. Like it's, and I call it third iteration. I think it's called something else, but it wasn't implemented yet. Yeah. I don't know what the time frame of is Club Penguin. Um, I knew at the end they made the iceberg uh, flip, which was good. Um, yeah, rewritten was after the main Club Penguin closed. Yeah, I'm I'm more speaking about like what version of Club Penguin they actually utilized. Like, I I heard they utilized uh, the Club Penguin like before the third like. Re um, reboot or whatever. A pet store was also used as a main adoption area. That makes a lot of sense. That makes a ton of sense. So I talked about Canon and I talked about Fanon and I talked about this wonderful thing being the first thing you see on the uh, Club Penguin Pookie. Wait, what the fuck? What is this link? This is complete, like, this is com All right, hang on, I need to close all my Chrome tabs. <laughs> Disorders and medical conditions in the, from the Club Penguin Pookie Wiki on fandom.com. I mean, we already talked about death and how there's racism apparently, so. I mean, we all also already talked about illness. Oh my, uh, holy shit. There's a... <gasps> yes! Sids is here. If you don't know, Sids is a... Yeah, this gender discrimination too. Which is interesting, because when Leland was talking about it, um, he mentioned it almost sounding like it was written from a perspective of someone that was very angry. Um, uh, if you don't know what SIDS is, SIDS is Sudden Infant Death Syndrome. Um, you can kind of already guess what it is. Uh, I, I appreciate that it's on here. I very much appreciate that SIDS is on here as a potential condition your Pookie can have. Boy, that would be a fun roleplay session. Um, yeah, oh man, there is a... There is a lot on the, the Club Penguin Pookie wiki that is really deep. Which is why some of this bewilders me, because a lot of it is like, here's Club Penguin. Club Penguin Pookie Crib Death isn't what I thought I'd hear. Well, <laughs> I apologize, but this is the reality of the Club, Club Penguin Pookie Wiki, where... There are life-threatening uh, conditions and uh, conditions and syndromes you can have. How much sanity did you lose so far? Well, not much yet. I'm. I've I've taken a very analytical approach to this, which it's like how the Star Wars wiki has an article on like everything that's happened in the lore. Yeah. And what kind of what I've been talking about how this bewilders me and how this just weirds me out and the most bewildering thing and this is something that's funnily enough um, echoed in Scrunchcraft as well is you have Club Penguin you have you have this guy you have Club Penguin this is Club Penguin Club Club Penguin. Um, you have a Club Penguin, which is a children's browser MMO. 
Gender dysphoria is on there as well, and ADHD, but it's labeled as attention definition hyperactivity disorder, which is not what it's called. Only on the Club Penguin uh, Pookie Wiki. You get this very innocent um, game, Club Penguin, for Scrunchcraft um, related purposes, Minecraft. You get this game, which for the most part is lighthearted. Um, it's pretty light on actual events. Uh, it's more of a blank canvas sort of state. And Club Penguin a little bit more in structured than Minecraft because it's Club Penguin. It's a browser MMO for kids. Um, and what you get here is you get a sort of role play uh, side thing, community uh, thing that is very, very, uh, that can seem very dark, which is where I like the phrase funny blocks game, funny block game, because you essentially get the same thing here, funny penguin game. When will socks reveal the children's grunge MMO? I'm hoping never. <laughs> I'm hoping I never have to worry about us running an MMO, especially geared towards children, ever. Although that's also just Roblox. Um, let's go back to types of pookies. There's a lot of pookies. Wait. There's a lot of pookies. The community server? Yeah. The... Yeah. Uh... Yeah. The community server... You really did just get me there. Um... Homeless... Homeless pookies. We need to talk about homeless pookies. I mentioned this. Nobody on Sludge will adopt me. Uh, let's talk about homeless pookies. Please do not start adoptions. What if, uh, let's talk about, I don't need this. So we talked about homeless groups of fam fams we, uh, now let's talk about homeless pookies I like the, uh, the mention here on the introduction of the homeless pookies page that says that mentions they are basically the poor version of normal pookies which, remember that Pookies are like ages 1 to 7, which this is all sorts of fucked up. I'm going to start typing like a Pookie exclusively in the community server, okay? Wait, I like this trivia. Sometimes they might explain how they are homeless. For example, lost fam fam in a car crash. Oh, that's something else. Hang on, I need to pull out the catchphrases. I want to talk about some of the catchphrases because some of them are fucking wild to me. Um, where is it? Where is it? Um, it's here somewhere. I think it's one of the last ones. Please, for the love of God, do not do pookie talk in the community server. I will destroy all of you. Where is it? Oh, yeah, here we go. We got some good ones here, like... Runs in faster than speed of light. Make, sh make sure to mention that this is uncommon. Gets thrown in by speeding car. Make sure to mention that this is rare. Um... Where is it? 
There's another one on here that's like a variation of the runs in faster than speed of light, which I loved. Where is it? I think it was like runs in slower than speed of sound, which activated a neuron in my brain that made me never forget that. Yeah, make sure to mention that this is rare. <laughs> There's, there's another one on here that says, uh, I don't think it's in either of the papers I'm holding right now. Um, one, one of them was like, oh, here it is. Plays on computer. Plays on computer. Rare. So, I guess playing on the computer for Pookies is rare. Which, there's like the only bit of lore that we've discerned this entire hour and a half that we've been doing this. I don't even know how much longer I can go for. Um, is Fresh from Club Penguin Hospital. I don't know how... I don't know how... I don't know how to feel about describing a baby penguin as fresh, but... <sighs> I, don't, I don't know. That, that just completely destroyed me. Fresh from a hospital. Yep, that's a... That is... I don't know how to feel about it. God, that hospital drip. Oh, God. You know, you got those, like, light blue socks on that they give you. Sure is something I had to hear with my ears. Yep. What else do I got here? I had uh, runs in slower than speed of sound, but it is gone now. I do not know where it went. I I really don't know where it where it went because it's actually. Oh no! Here it is. Storms in slower than speed of sound. Plague jester, thank you. Storms in slower than speed of sound is like such a funny like that's such a funny inverse on saying faster than the speed of light that is a like that's a hilarious inverse of still being incorrect i love that what else do i got here there's a lot of phrases here wait doesn't understand biggie tiggy language doesn't understand big kid language. <laughs> what? Usually, this is... Welcome to another, uh, another bit. This will probably be the last thing I mention here. Because we're, we're getting to the tail end of this. This is an outsider looking in perspective and such. Um... Usually, as a child learns a language, they learn how to speak, they learn how to write, whatever. They're usually learning it from people who know how to speak English. They're learning it from adults who know how to speak English. They're constantly hearing words and reading words that are correct. And so the assumption with this language, the, the assumption with sort of translating uh, to pooky speech, uh, it, it, I don't know. I'm I'm picking apart. Uh, I, I I'm picking apart. Uh, pooky language, which feels like uh, a, a bit of waste time in and of itself, but ideally, it would just be the speech that's incorrect. The speech that's 
baby. They're still able to understand that. But, uh... I don't know. It's... The, the one thing that I can say about all of this is that this is one of those things that... This is one of those communities. This is one of those things that takes place. This is one of those everything in detail segments that I look at, I read over, I consider, I, I dissolve everything. And I'm just sort of confused at the end of it. <laughs> There's a lot over years and years, like some of these, like some of these articles that I'm pulling up from are six, seven, eight years old. They're old. This is ancient. It mentions events happening in 2009, 2008. These are old. And that's sort of a wild thing for me here, is that this is old. This goes back a long time. This is... <laughs> this entire idea is older than a lot of the kids that would be playing Club Penguin. Which is wild. It's one of those things that, like, I, I consider a lot. Where it's like, as years go on and as time goes on, like, take um, my Roblox account. Uh, I made that in 2008. It turns 13 years old this year. My Roblox account is older than most kids playing Roblox today. Which is wild to me. That's something that I don't consider a lot but you you take the time to think about that and it's like something that i've done or that i've seen happen goes on years and you think back and it's like why that's old like 2015 was six years ago and you you sort of think back on that and it's like oh yeah that's recent but then you, you take a moment and it's like why that is old 2015 six years ago one and a half of a decade that's the wild thing here that's what i love about this is that this is information over years in years and like all in the other fun part about it is that for the most part the people behind these, when whenever you do something like this, you do this deep dive into it. I remember adopting a Pookie once when I was a kid, but I didn't have a membership, so I didn't have a cool igloo. So she immediately left after she saw it. That is incredible. I am sorry for your loss. Um... This whole thing is one of many. This is one of many communities that happen. This is one of many events that will happen. And it's what you see a lot. And that's real fun. Yeah, Meverse. There's a Meverse wiki. And it's four years after Meverse shut down. Like, you, you think about things that end. This is still something that's going on, too. Which is the impressive thing. Communities come and go, but uh, some of them, like the Club Penguin. Uh oh. Hachi, thank you for the raid. Uh oh. Whoa. Hi. I'm. A, I'm about. Uh. I'm about wrapping up. Actually. I'm kind of wrapping up here. I went through most of what I wanted to talk about. Um. I can show you death. I can show you death though. There's the, the wiki page for death on the, the Club Penguin Pookie wiki. Uh, but, yeah, this is, like, as silly as this is, as silly as you can look at it and kind of kind of laugh at it from the sidelines, this is also something that you can give a lot of respect to. And it's not something you'd usually give respect, but... It's something really interesting. 
I still don't know what the penguins like called if they're not just called penguins, but I think that is it then. Oh, hang on. Something is wrong here. Hang on. Uh-oh. Wait, what is... Hang on. Ho hold on for just a moment. Uh... Bear with me for one moment. I'm not actually sure what's going on. No. Okay. OBS has frozen. I, I don't know what's going on with it. It's been fine. Uh, oh, God. Oh, God. No, no, no. Listen. Listen to me. The stream has been compromised. Do not listen to anything they say. Again, the stream has been compromised. Do not listen to a single word they say. God. Oh, fuck, I thought I got away. Do not listen to a...